It was a great day. Hmm. What? Hey folks, welcome back to another edition of RV of the Tanners. I'm Jim. I'm Melinda. Hey, uh, we're in the middle of a uh, seven week trip. We're kind of wandering around Oregon, Idaho, and Washington. And one of the things we've been doing, uh, just personally, and we're not blogging it out to you guys, is our own personal journals. Uh, my mom used to write these constantly when we were little kids and going camping. And what a hoot to go back and read these. Um, and she's got them for years. <laughs> it's awesome. Um, but my mom, when we first got an RV, yes. bless her heart, she gave Melinda the first journal. And Melinda took it from there and just started writing and writing. Right. And since we're on this um, sabbatical with a seven-week adventure, we want mm -hmm. to be able to go back and remember all the adventures that we've been able to yep. take. Yep. Uh, and be able to revisit and be able to share with uh, family and friends what we've been able to do. What's really hard is that when you come back and you try to capture everything on paper with just words, sometimes it just doesn't really... Uh, put right there or capture, capture the moment yeah. capture the moment really well but taking our phones along oh, and being able great. to take pictures we've been able to use this hp sprocket to come back and print out the pictures that we take in order to connect with the words that we're putting down in our journal yeah uh, we actually have a contest <laughs> who could take the best picture on our hikes Melinda normally wins. I do. I never, I don't have a good eye for it, but it's, it, when I do win, it's a big deal it's for me. It's a great day. <laughs> it's a win. Um, <laughs> but really cool. Um, so now, I guess you probably write like a quarter of what she used to have mm -hmm. to write. Um, even on this seven week trip, I'm <laughs> thumbing back through it late at night. I'm like, oh yeah, remember that? It's so cool. So when you come along something like this, not once in a lifetime thing, but really just a must have. It's just, it's a, a quintessential of and an addition to documenting your yourself and, re, and your life and remembering going back mm -hmm. and the nice thing about it here's an example of one of them it's only two by three inches so it doesn't take up a huge amount of space mm -hmm. in the journal right and it's just a little picture and that's all you need to spark that memory in your mind and go oh yeah that was great i remember that so we hope that this kind of thing is is useful to you and you can look forward to maybe picking one up and and documenting your life with pictures as well well, we'll kind of show you how it works. We'll mm -hmm. do an interface to the phone. Uh, we'll do one to print out the picture and then show you what it looks like in our journal. All right, so let's show you how it works. All right, so what Melinda's gonna do is kind of open up the application. Oh, by the way, that's free. You can download it. And then we'll pick a picture from our hike today. Let's choose this one. This was a great view. And the great thing is, is that you can see that there's a white band at the top and the bottom, but you are able to turn your picture if you'd like. Wait, what? I, okay, so I didn't know that. Obviously, this is Melinda's thing. And expand it and kind of get to the point where you would like. Nice. And then once you find the view that you would like, go ahead and push print. So it's talking to it. Sending it. And quick as that, how it prints the picture that you have from your phone. What's nice is that it has a sticky back. You just have to find that tricky corner. So peel the sticky part back. Find the perfect spot in your book. And put it right in. And there it is. Hey folks, thanks for watching. I uh, hope you've gotten a lot out of this. Uh, we really use that HP Sprocket quite a bit and I, I hope maybe you pick one up and enjoy it as much as we have. Mm -hmm. If you see this little thing down here, she's kind of out of the picture right now. This is Ruby. Uh, this is our new dog. We got her from the Guide Dog of the Blind. We'll do a video on that, uh, but she's basically taken over the RV. Uh, if you have any questions on anything you've seen, just put a question down below. We'll get back to you as soon as possible. Hey, uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Oh, good, the air conditioner's gone. That won't be hurt. That's not loud. Hey, folks, Jim with our view with the Tanners. What did you say? I'm Jim. I hey, did. I said, hey, folks, Jim with our view with the Tanners. No, you said, hey, folks, it's... <laughs> Jim. And that's Ruby. So, uh, we'll phone... Uh, we'll let a bed part out. <laughs> 
Uh, Try that again then. The whole thing? Sure. Wow. Take two. And then you can press print. Does a quick search for it. Out of paper. We've been printing so much that now we're out of paper. Well, hold on a sec, folks. We'll <laughs> be right back. So if you haven't done so yet, please remember to hit the subscribe button and then hit the little bell so that it reminds you when we post new videos. Mm -hmm.